next act is an escapologist. <laughs> and take it from me, Danger is his middle name. Well, that's a coincidence, isn't it? I've been an escapologist and your middle name's Danger. <laughs> yeah, no, well, no. Do you know, sometimes I wish I had a buzzer. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's, it's Merlin Cadogan. Who are you? My name's Merlin. Through. This guy is a lunatic. What he does is crazy. Simon said I've got to step up the danger for the next round. How extreme could this go, Merlin? So this evening I really am putting my life on the line. The trick I'm performing tonight I have never performed before and it's definitely the most dangerous trick I've ever attempted. Every day I wake up, I train, I work, I train, I sleep, I train. Britain's got talent. It's become my life. In a live show, with millions of people watching, can he actually pull off this act? This could end up in a very, very bad way. It is really nerve-wracking. If it goes wrong, I will die. Here he is, let's hear it, from Merlin Cadogan. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This evening, I'll be putting my life on the line. I'm going to attempt to escape from a straitjacket whilst hanging upside down on a burning rope. Harry Houdini broke two ribs attempting this stunt and said it was the most dangerous of all of his escapes. He never tried this stunt with a rope on fire. It will take about one minute for the rope to burn through. If I haven't completed my escape by this time, I could die. Wish me luck. Dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you said you said Houdini's never tried that with the rope on fire. Yeah. He just hung from the rope, did he? Yes. And there was a real possibility of that burning through and you and you dropping and totally, yeah. And my life was literally on the line. Yeah. Well, it paid off, and uh, I've done my finger in as well. Oh, I wouldn't worry about that. Right. Finger, I wouldn't worry about I could, that. I could still vote. The, the judges, the judges said they wanted to see real danger and real jeopardy. You, you delivered that for them. I couldn't do any more. Let's see what the judges thought of it. Amanda, let's start with you. Yeah, I mean, there was definitely a real risk element to that, and I absolutely loved your first audition. I don't know whether I made a mistake, to be honest, in not buzzing you. Because I thought that, that, that fire was burning the other way, and I wasn't sure, actually, whether you would have burnt to death had you not got out of the 
straps. Amanda. The danger was falling from 10 Amanda. feet? Yes. He wasn't going to burn to death. He was going to fall <laughs> on his head. That's what was going to kill him. No, if he'd have fallen from eight foot on his head, he would have died. Okay. He wasn't going to burn to death. The fact is, <laughs> is that you still delivered exactly what you said. This is a variety show. You've added a completely different <laughs> element to the show tonight. So, and I didn't buzz you for a good reason. Thank you, Amanda. Thank you. Simon, what did you think? Well, this just doesn't make any sense at all. Did you want him to burn to death or what? <laughs> There to be even the more rope fire. The was supposed to catch fire, snap, falls on his head, and he dies. He nearly did it. <laughs> and I've got to tell you, you know, anyone who's prepared to die on this show yeah, exactly. gets a 10 out of 10 for me. <laughs> Thank you very much, Simon. Thank you. Very briefly, please. Very briefly. Very briefly. Merlin also very, very, I like you. I think you're a nice yeah. guy. I think you're an honest guy. And I hope you do well too. Yeah. I like Thank you. you very much. Thank, Thank you, Judges. If you think Merlin can make it to the final, the number to call is on. I know double one thirty two twenty two or two, but not yet. Lines don't open until we've seen all the acts. One more time, Merlin can do it. <laughs>